Hello and welcome to Atlantic Candlepin Signals Tour coming to you from Lita Lanes in Nashville, New Hampshire. I'm Paul Grant along with Dennis Nuzzo and Bad Susi today, head to head, Atlantic Candlepin Singles Tour week two. I'm back. Dennis, not bowling at all the first week. You're ten and four inheritance. Not a bad one. Good, good for being bowling as a ghost, huh? <laughs> I'll take it. You know? And all you can do is face the ten stringer winner, uh, Matt Susi today. That's all. You no, know, slight talent. I, former ACSC champion from last year. Nah. St. Patrick's Day winner. Nah. <laughs> yeah. No, Matt's a great bowler. He really is. Tell us how you got started in Kenneth Bowling, and tell us about your memorabilia business, too. Uh, I started when I was four years old. Um, the, the, the only thing I can remember is, you know, going to a bowling alley, wanting to go to a bowling alley when I was that young, and just, just loving it, the crashing of the pins, you know, seeing the pins explode, watching other people bowl, you know, mm -hmm. seeing the pros on TV. Uh, it just hooked me right from the get-go. Yeah. Love it. How'd you get into your, your business doing sports uh, memorabilia? memorabilia? Uh, I've always been a big sports fan, big Boston hockey fan, uh, Bruins always. Um, I'm going to get some flack for this, but I've been a Buffalo Bills fan my whole life. Yeah, I know. Good got, time to be one now. Yeah, well, right now it is, but back in the 90s, it wasn't so much. You know, I got into a lot of fights with people, but <laughs> um, it just, you know, I've collected stuff over the years, and I say, you know, what if I find some stuff that other people want, and I, I knew people in the business, and I just started uh, working with uh, Sports World in Saugus, my good friend Phil, who I've been dealing with since he opened like 30-something years ago. Uh, and it was just snowball from there. And it's, I love it. I love doing it. I love uh, helping people find what they're looking for or it's collecting stuff in my own personal collection. It's really, really yeah, how, nice. how do they get a hold of you to buy this stuff? Uh, you can reach me on Facebook. Either just send me a message on Dennis Nuzzo or uh, on Facebook. The group is Nuzzo's Memorabilia and Collectibles. Uh, either way, if you need the link, just shoot me a message and I'll, I'll give it to you. And don't forget, WOW shirts are great collectible too. That's, see, that's one, <laughs> almost one of a kind right there. You get, get your WOW shirt now. Okay. Good luck today. Thank you. We'll talk to Matt Susie real sure. quick. Matt, traveling from Maine this morning on vacation. Matt, you awake yet? <laughs> a little bit. a really good year. Good to see you again. You really good year. Has it sunk in you won the ACST championship yet? Uh, off to a new season. Now I just got to defend. Yeah, it sounds like Bill Belichick, right? We're moving yeah. on, right? That's all right. Yeah. One day at a time. So how do you feel like bowling against a ghost today who inherited jo uh, Joey List's 10-4 record? That's all right. I don't mind. Nuzzo, I bowled with Nuzzo. He brought me into the pro league. So I'm grateful for that. Now I get to bowl against him. You're in a very tough division. You have Nick Leach and, and, and Dean Sullivan bowling later tonight here also. Yep. Really tough division to defend your title. Ah, they're old. Are you ready for your 20 stringer on Saturday? Yeah, I get to defend that too. <laughs> okay. Good luck today. <laughs> Thank you. So it's a five string four man as usual in the Atlantic Camp and Singles Tour. Two points for a win, one for tie, four for total. It's going to weigh now from Lita Lanes, Nash, New Hampshire. We've got Lexi here today, the president of the New Hampshire Camp and Association here as well. She's a big Nebraska fan. That's good to know. I'm a big Nebraska Cornhusker fan too. Shouldn't say it these days are terrible in football. Ever since Tom Osborne left. He's in lanes 33 and 34 today. Thank you for watching the special Monday broadcast just after 11 o'clock here. Dennis, the head pin hit, has the 247, the 8 behind the 2 pin, a great piece of wood in front. For a spare, no. Couldn't get to the 8, good bid. Dennis Nuzzo, N-U-Z-Z-O, a nine to start, the first of five. Dennis, 47 years old. Sporting those purple and green 2.7 pound Cobra bowling balls. We're in Dexter Shoes, average of 110 these days. In its peak, he was 123 as a bowler. He has the 13710. Thank you for watching early on. Tell your friends about the great game of Candlepin Bowling. Subscribe free on YouTube to ACST Facebook page and Candlepin Bowling Network. Beautiful shot. Oh, he got it. Beautiful. Off the wall. That came out of nowhere. 19 of the ball through two here in the first. He'll take it. Yeah, thank you for giving me Terrific matchup today. On the bonus, on the head pin, it's eight, has the half to right, the three and nine, one piece of wood. 27 through two. For a spare, missed the object pin.
Wide left. Buffalo Bills field goal. Scott Norwood. Wide left. Nine bucks. 36 for three. It's Buffalo Bills reference to the 90s team. Lost to the Giants 2019 when they missed a field goal at the end. Lost four playoff games in a row. Four Super Bowls in a row. Nuzzo. Left ahead pin has the four spin right. The one, three, six, and ten. These go about 36% for Pro Bowls. That would. You know what call it? the Kimrowski special. That's Rick Kimrowski. He just missed one of that one. Ends up with a nine, 45 through four in the first of five. Second week, the ACST typically an 18, is an 18 week season, bowling twice a month on average. Four team divisions, 16 teams in each conference. This is the Northern Conference. They bowl each other in the same division the first three weeks, and the last three weeks. And all of the balls once, six home, six away the rest of the season. Good head for he has the four left, the six to the right. That won't count. I'm the gutter. Minus one. That's one way. That'd be a nine box. 54 half. So it's Sperry, the second box. Help them out. And Matt Seuss, the defending Atlantic Kettleman Singles Tour champion in the Pro Division last year, now the Class A Division. We two match up here. Starts his first to five. Just terrific bowler, having a great year. Dr. Seuss breaks the bundle of six, steals more. It's eight. That three pin trying to get to the head pin for Julian. For a spare. Yes. Ten of the ball to start his match. Up one plus a ball, up against a spare eight here, and a 54 half from Dennis Nezzo. And after a 184 last year in the ACST. A high three last season was 423, and a high five is 677 in the ACST last year. Beautiful ball, nine on the spare. Spare. 19 up to one up, 10 right now. The average of 119. Another one, right on it. Two spares to start the match. 29 of the ball through two. Up two plus a ball. He has been on fire overall this year. Overall high single, 189. High triple, 442. High five, 672. Lead 33. Left, my least favorite shot, the half west of two. 31 through 2, up 4 in the string. Second ball, but 2 accurate. 3 to the right, 4 7 left. Matt from Nashua, New Hampshire, his whole life. Bowls here at Elite Lanes in Nashua. 36 lane facility, great place to bowl. Good effort, only got 1 for an 8. 39 through 3 of 3 in the string. Let's be sure the scores again. Usually every five boxes. Once in a while we'll throw it a little more often. Excellent week two matchup here in Nashua. So we see back and head pin crosses over, gets eight. The five and the wobbling nine. Two pinners go about 51% for Pro Bowls. That would stats provided by Kenneth and Bowling Network. For another one. You got it. Kicked on the outside. Third spare in four boxes to start the match. 49 of the ball. Up four plus this. Bonus, nice ball, eight. Has the seven, eight. Some wood to help. Four for five in the head pin. 57 through four of 12.
for another spare. Got it! Right between the two pieces of wood. Precision shooting by Matt Susie. Four spares in the first half, in the first of five from National New Hampshire. Lita Lanes, 67 on the ball. 13 pin lead plus one. We we'll switch over to lane 34. And you should be sleep deprived more often. A long tri trip, several hours from Maine today. Ball in this match. Dennis Nenzel gets two out of 54 half, a spare eight in the second. Two left side, ouch. Dennis High single 187. Nice out. Not bad for that. Nine box, 63 through six. If you missed it, look at that start from Matt Susie. Spare two. Half Worcester Phil hurt him, but not bad. Dennis crosses over the head pin, gets eight, has the goal pulse to 7 10. So he can use those two pieces of wood to kick it over. That one in front might be an issue. We'll see how it plays it. Nice try. And no good, he said. Hit the wood in the gutter. So, Bolo's call. Nine box, 72 through seven. Five, nine box in a row. Six in the string. One spare eight. Throw a decent ball overall. Right of the head pin has the one, nine, and ten. Two pieces of wood off to the left and then back. Nuzzo just missed. So close. These are just the head pin. Wide right for nine. Seven nine boxes in the string, six in a row, 81 through eight. Nine's a while here in Nashua. So Matt looking good here in the first string, as of right now. Trying to get the first two points, the match. 14 points over on the grabs. Dennis wide right. One, two, eight behind the two pin, the 10 pin right corner, three pieces of wood. One eight ten left up. Can't find the head pin lately. And broke the nine curse, got an eight though. Eighty nine through nine. So in trouble here in the first. We had a sixty seven plus one half coming up next. Both ten and four coming in. Same division. Nuzzo, nice ball there, but a 2-1 split. 4-7 in the 10. No wood, no luck. Just 50% in the head pin in the first string. Shots up one. Pick your favorite pin here. And that's nine in the gutter. That won't count. This eight box make it so 97 disappointing string. So Matt Susi in the driver's seat here early on. 67 the ball. Just needs 98 to win. Trying to pile on the lead here. Dennis capable of striking back quickly. On the spare fill, it's eight more. The two and the seven. Five or six in the head pin. 75 half of 21 in the string. For another one. Got it. 
Three spears in a row. Give that man some bonus money. Five spears and six boxes. Wow, what a start. A seven fill. He wins the string already. There it is for strike. Look, oh, yes, strike on spare. He's got four marks in a row. Six out of seven. 95 through six, 105 plus two through seven. Amazing. Going a high level. Cross the head pink, it's seven as the half was to three nine, the ten won't be easy. Wood coming out of play, I believe. Working on a strike. He's won the string with three boxes in hand. This would be something. On the object paid, wouldn't carry. Surprised that didn't go the way he's throwing the ball. That's the nine and ten. Eight in the strike. One thirteen through seven. Good pinning nine, 122 through eight. Yes, see in the Candle Pitcher Kansas show, he started 169 first string from Keith Beaupre, and then Corey Pack had returned the paper with a 169 in his first string in the second match. Watch us all at Candle Bowling Network. Great matches yesterday. So you see open box for a change, spread eagle, accurate shot, 247 left, 3610 on the right. In the hole. Eight for nine in the head pin here on the first. Tough six that time. Human form, the ninth box, 128 through nine. He's already up 31 in the string of the box in hand. Has the first two points. Another spread eagle, piece of wood to help this time. Nine for ten, the head pin face Sawyer was nine for ten last Thursday. Only a 99 strength, so no guarantee. You get a high score, but lines are in your favor. Susie so again in the hole, second time in a row doing that. At least he's on the head pin, you could say. Chucks a one for a top five, a six and a five. A fine 133. They have a 132 officially in the screen. I have 133, but there it is. I've changed now. 133 is official. So Matt Susie, a whopping 133, 97 win. Up 36 in the match with four more to go. From Atlanta Candlepin Singles Tour, Class A Division, Week 2 matchup. All on Grimke Live on Facebook, on the ACST page. Welcome those on Candlepin Bowling Network and Candlepin Chat. Strong performance by Matt Susie. And those two boxes, he's on the head pin, the spread eagles back to back. Just punched through a lot. Missed a couple of shots in the middle. We'll go back over to lane 33 to start a second string. We'll put the recap up in just a moment. Dennis Nazo, half west to left. Start off good. He had 27 in his first two, but since then, a lot of nines and eights. Susie. That first. 1479. Matt cheering them on. Nice out. For an eight. Tomorrow night, special presentation, the ladies bowling matchup, Tuesday night speed league, main broadcast on Kenneth Bowling Network. Going to Big 20 in Scarborough, Maine at 6.30. Amanda Carroll's team with Brooke Betteridge, doubles partner, and her mother, Sue Brown. We'll take on Shannon Scribner's team with Kelsey Layton and Kristen Hayes. Up in just a moment. 
pretty much the same shot, the 1479. Good ball. Wouldn't carry. Good try. So that's tomorrow night, main broadcast. 6.30, Amanda Carroll's team. Great lineup. Wide right for an 8, 16 through 2. Big 20 bowling center tomorrow night. Scarborough and Maine. Watch that on Camelton Bowling Network tomorrow night. Go, ladies, go. Dennis trying to find his rhythm here. Had been a 3 1 split, the 2 4 7 and the 10. Joey List to bowl the first week. Had to drop out. That's inherits a 10 4 record. Nice try. 7 10 goalpost. And there's nine watts, 25 through three, second or five. And it's trying to get going here in the second. There's a nice ball there, but another split, the four seven and the six ten to the right. The wood got the ten. Right, Only one spear eight in the second box. The first string open since. Nice out for a nine. Thirty four through four. Thursday night ten and four. Faye Sawyer takes on ten and four. Kevin Baker from Maine. The Atlantic Hamilton Singles Tour Class B Division at six p.m. Lakeside Lanes, Manchester, New Hampshire. Uh, she was eleven and three, but after a technicality, they found out afterwards. The tie was not a tie, it was a one pin loss. So there's a good ball by Dennis. He has the five pin left up, so she'll be taking on Kevin Baker. We'll cover more on that in just a moment. Another set of balls joining them. That's Thursday night, six o'clock on ACST. And there's a spare. Breaks the curse, 14 in a row without a mark. 44 half, so an encouraging sign here in the second. Matt Susi, a thrilling 133 first. Half asleep coming in, pulling like he's wide awake. Starting his second. He's been great to watch all year. He's been tremendous. Close right has the one, two, seven, and ten. One piece of wood. Ball on the object pin, he wouldn't carry as the two and the ten. Matt nine for ten on the head pin in the first string. A nice out, almost got to the ten. Nine box, one pin lead in the string. Thirty seven in the match. So, face Sawyer Thursday night, six p.m. Kevin Baker, 102 103 average last year, averaging 117 right now. All and Ken, four and ten, will join them. Lakeside Lanes on ACST Facebook page, Thursday, 6 p.m. Susie left the head pin. Similar shot he had in the first string. One piece with the hangs on this time, though. Three, nine, and a ten. Just missed left. Had five spares and one strike in that first string, and a half whistle of two and one of them. So it's two spread eagles, six and a five at the end. Cost him a 140 plus. He gets a nine. Seven. They make it 18 through two, up two in the string, 38 in the match. Pin, almost strike, almost. Seven pin left up, 72% success rate for four walls without wood. Stats provided by Kenneth and Bowl Network on single pins. Who needs wood? Spare. 
28 of all through three. Six spares, one strike of the match. The Friday Night Pro League on Kenneth Polo Network this Friday, September 30th, 8 p.m. Wolverine 2, after a tough start against Red Hot Central 2. Chris Winniards, the Douglas Brothers, Scott and Tim, Rich Lamoni. And Dan Chenard, who won the doubles match, Pro Series, with Steve Reno Jr. at Lee Lanes Saturday night. We'll be on there. 8 p.m. right after that on Kenneth and Bowen Abbott Friday night. So you see the triangle. Over now, seven of that fill, 35 through three, up 10 in the string, 46 in the match. Goes the two and the five, gets a 10. 45 through four, up 11 in the string, 47 in the match. So that's Friday night, 8 p.m. Moving to Central, two at Central Park Lanes, East Boston, Mass. Same two balls, rosters, Nate Lees, Dave Haji Malahan, Mark Hollywood Smith, Scott Lapierre, Eddie Woodside. Susie drops nine more. Four pin left up. And he's on his head pin, on this object pin again. Second spare of the string in the last three boxes. 55 half plus one. Paul Griffey live from Lead Lanes, Nash, New Hampshire. You're watching the Atlantic Candlepin Singles Tour. Class A Division, Week 2. Dennis Nuzzo, 44 in the ball. Now 47 in the match. After a big first by Matt Susie. There's a good ball strike! And that's ball like Dennis. That's on spare. 54 half, 64 plus 2. Explosive shot. Third mark of the match. Two spares, one strike. So can use another one on the head pin. Breaks away the right side as the 4 7 spare leaves. Working on a strike. Fifty-one percent success rate for pro balls, not wood or two pinners. Stats for the top ball network. And you got one on. Tough miss. Nine of the strike though, seventy-three through six. Nice ten. Eighty-three through seven, the second of five. Dennis from East Boston and Revere Mass growing up, now lives in Saugus Mass. 110 league bowler, high single, 187, high triple, 484. It's high five is 719, and a high 10 of 1330. Those are Sunnyside Bowl Drone, Danvers Mass, and Metro Bowl, Peabody Mass. Been bowling since 1979. Ross is over. Good ball, but a 5 7 split. Let's see if we can use that wood to help out. Six straight in the head pin here. Good sign. And kick it over. Oh, so close. Good try. Nine box. 92 through eight. Dennis uh, had a work injury, so he was never work out, put on some weight, expected his bowling, he said. So he's been working out lately, doing really good, getting in good shape. Trying to get back to his glory days of 123 average. Half was to write the three and nine. It's a former King of the Palace champion, has an East Boston singles title, and a rock and ball knockout winner. Boosh, that's a ball shot in the hole. Favorite bowling moment was bowling in the world tournament. Five to go. Tough five. 97 through nine. Jesse starts getting going. Tough box. The 97 in the first. Matt had a 133. 
So it needs a mark here to compete for the string win, trying to even up the match at 2 2. On the head pin. Decent piece of wood, the 247 and the 8 behind the 2 pin. 70% in the head pin, the string. And got it to go for a spare. Third mark of the string, a strike and two spares. 107 the ball on the 10. Off to the right, gets seven out of that. And ends up with a 114. Second string, nice bounce back. 97 and 114. 211 through two. And Matt Susie on a spare. Trying to go 4 0. 55 and a ball. Both well, of these, probably one more mark. A chance to take a second straight string. Both balls 10 and 4 coming in. Matt defeated Dean Sullivan. That first week. Dennis and Harry, Dennis and uh, Joey Lister's 10 4 record. Lucy on the spare, just three that time. 58 half, up four in the string, 40 in the match. Now he needs a mark to win the string. Good second ball, leaves up the seven and the 10, but the 10 goes away, now it's just a seven. Good second ball. Dennis had a strike nine in this box. Just used the wood, wouldn't go for a nine. 67 through six, trailing for the first time in the, in the string. 73 67, Dennis up by six in the string. Matt up 30 in the match. Needs 48 and four boxes to take the string. On the head pin. Can't break up the split. It has the six to the right, two pieces of wood, the four seven to the left. Five spares and one strike in that first, two spares here in the second. Nothing doing. Matt told me at the Cheech's last year against Corey Packard, Dave Barber, and Joy Lister that he's never won anything before. Oh, nice out, 9. 76 through 7, down 7 in the string, up 29 in the match. You told me you never won anything before, and I said, well, coming in fourth place out of 65 or 65 balls is pretty good. And this year, he's won three things. St. Patrick's Day, recent 10 string, and the Atlantic Hamilton Singles Tour Championship Pro Division, not Class A. Not a bad year. Nice ball for a strike, it's 9. The king pin leaves up, the 5 pin, the wood going right by, had a clean shot at it. Head on. These single pins today so far. He despair and he missed it. Announces Jinx. Paul Grant special missed the second, make the third. Ten blocks, 86 to 8. Two blocks to go in the second of five from Nashua at Lee Lanes. So Matt needs a mark. Needs to get to 115. 29 pins. Two boxes. Accurate shot, spread eagle minus one, a clipped wing eagle. Two, four, seven left, the three, six to the right. Chopped out one. Maybe at least three here, and only one for a tough seven. 93 through nine, down four, it's up at spare seven. He's a double strike to win. Otherwise, it's 2-2. Two, two. Open second half, it's spare seven and spare three in the first half. Well, strong 133 first. That's the 2-4 spare leaf. Seven for 10 on the head pin this string, nine for 10 on the first. For a spare. Yes, off the wall, got it. 103 in a ball. Dennis has won the string. It's two points apiece. Well, 
eight spears and one strike of the match. Nice ball, eight. Ends up with 111, loses by three. 114, 111. 244 through two. So a tie, two points apiece. So Dennis gets in the win column on his own. No inheritance this time. But Matt Susie leads the match by 33 with three strings to go. Three strings to go from Nashua, New Hampshire, Lita Lanes, the Atlantic Hamilton Singles Tour Class A Division. Week two of 18 matchup. If you're interested in bowling the Atlantic Hamilton Singles Tour, please message Danny Finn. Be on standby. Case an injury. Three divisions, A, B, C, and a division in Maine. Contact Matt Hoff if you're interested in Maine. We'll get your name and list for next season. Dennis has the 1 9, starting the third of five. 97 and 114, his first two, 2 11. Good effort there, it won't go. That's all you can do. Wide right for nine to start the third. Recap the first two strings. 97 114 for Dennis. At 133, 111. A 33 coming in. Two points apiece so far. Dennis crosses over. And that Matt Susie had the shot twice earlier. He's got more wood to help though. The three nine half Worcester, the ten to the right. For a spare, he missed the object pin. He's at the three and ten. Missed opportunity. Nuzzo, nine, 17, I make it 18 through two. Okay. And as a four years old, love watching Kenneth Bowling on TV. Love to see the pins flying in the air. I like my Kenneth and Bowling song I wrote. Right, that time, the one, two, eight behind the two, and the nine. It's got three, well, the nine goes away. Now, got a chance, the one, two, and eight. Let's see if we can drill this through. And missed it right. Nine blocks again, 27 through three. It's six nines in a row on the first string. Three nines to start the third, 27 through three. Myers Mike Morgan. Dennis says one of the best peop people he's ever met. Here's a good ball. But he splits 3 1. The four to the left, the three, six, ten to the right. Nice bid. He's up to four. Dennis said bowling was always his sport growing up. Played roller hockey in his teens through his 20s. Another nine. 36 through four playing poker here in the third. He's a huge hockey fan, huge Bruins fan. Most of the Buffalo Bills football team, the St. Louis Cardinals baseball team. Right side of the head pin gets five. The one, two, four, eight, and the ten. Just two for five in the head pin. Just not the third. Again, missing right. One, two, four, eight left up. Disappointing half. Open half. And you can't do it against Matt Susie. Drops out two for an eight. 44 half. Okay, Matt Susie up 33 in the match. The tie 2-2. Two, two. Starting up his third string, the, the current ACST championship winner from last season.
He's on lane 33 here in Lidl Reigns. Head pin, a little split there, a couple break up. Now it's this four, eight, and ten. Three pieces of wood. Sixteen for twenty on the head pin, the first two strings. Trying to sweep it over, just missed it left, trying to go inside that four pin. Good try, nine. Tied in the string of 33 in the match. Won the first, 133.97. Lost the second, 114.111. Back was to right. Seen a few of those today. Good second ball has the six ten to the right, the seven to the left, and the ten goes away. Maybe the seven goes. The seven goes. Wait a minute. Maybe the six will go. Holds up. A ten to take the lead in the string. He has it, 19-18 lead through two in the third of five. Man, all business in the lanes, loves poker, cornhole, and fishing. Has three kids, Natalie, Nick, and Zach, and his girlfriend, eight. One of the 20, 22 St. Patrick's Day tournament here at Lee Lanes. Get pin again, another split, two, four, seven, and a six. What a shot for a spare! The two, four, seven, the six. 29 of the ball through three here in the third of five. Nine spares and one strike so far in 23 boxes. On the head pin, crossing over, it's a triangle. The six, nine, and ten. Wood to help. 36 through 3, up 9 in the string, 42 in the match. Goes left, and look, oh, the ball comes right by it. No. I'm going to go a little more right in that wood. Just missed it. Heck of a bid. And Dennis Nezel, check that wood. I believe it's out of play. Past that 10 foot line. And it's out of play. Dennis really moves it. And it's extra workout here this morning. So, so 10. 46 and 4. 10 in the string. 43 in the match. Up against Nate. Looking up 4 to 2 here in the string. Great for a string. 133 97 victory. Almost pulled out the second string, lost 114, 111. Back what's left this time. You guys still watch my videos. Second ball, right in the pocket, it goes! What a shot for a spare, 56 half plus one. Ten spares and one strike. In the match, defending ACST Pro Division Championship, not Class A this year, has the lead in the match and the string. Dennis Nezzo, 44 half, trying to get his first mark of the string. Down 12 in the string, 45 in the match. Plus the ball from Matt Cece. Then it's just three spares and one strike. And the match one spare in the first, two spares and a strike in the second. On the toughest divisions. 
Dennis Nezzo, Matt Susi, Dean Sullivan, and Nick Leach will only run tonight here in Ashwa. One, two, six, ten. That's the object pin again. Look for a GPS signal for the head pin. It's nine. Fifty-three through six. They, they split the first two strings. Dennis Mary has three kids. So his injuries, let it carry in Salem, Mass. My hometown growing up. Goes right. It's four, maybe five. Five it is. Really needs his first confidence. And he drills it for a spare. 63 in a ball. First mark of the string. Need that one. Needs a couple more to help. Trying to dig out of that hole in the match. The Danny Kenilton singles tour class A division. Week two matchup. 18 week season. Matt Susi, Dennis Nuzzo. Division but battle. On the bonus. That looks good, but he splits 2 2. Sixty-nine through seven. Two four and a six ten. Good try. Oh, what a shot for a spin. Wow. Second spin in a row, the two, four, six, ten. Incredible. That's gotta get him going here. Seventy nine ball through eight. Trying to go up four two. The bonus head pin he has a check mark. The five to the right, the two, four, seven left. Two spare sixes in a row, 85 through eight, and the third of five. The three in a row, missed it. Try to go inside the two pin. That's the two, five, and the seven. A nice 10. 95 through nine. He had no 10 boxes in the first, just two in the second, and two here in the third. A correction, one of the third, just three 10 boxes all day. This bid for a strike, will it go? Not quite. What can left up? This third rock in the last four boxes. And he caps it through for a spare. Three out of four. And just missed four in a row by a smidgen. 105 and a ball. Six spares and one strike in the match. Look for big fill to finish his third string. A oh, quarter Wester, you gotta be kidding me. E Ouch. 106 string. He just killed your spirit. 317 for three. Matt Susi, 56 in the ball. Does not need a mark necessarily to win the string. Just let me get that in focus here for you. There we go. So, tough break there for Dennis. A great ball in that second half. Matt on the spare fill. Sizzles back. It's six. Center triangle and a seven pin. 62 half. Right now at 14 in the string. 47 in the match. And nice shot for a spare. Second in the row. Three in his last four. 72 in the ball through six. In the driver's seat for the second win. Try to go 4 2. On the spare. Nice ball. Eight. Has the four to the left, the eight to the right. 80 
to six. Look for three snares in a row on lane 34 here in Nashua. I'm checking that wood to make sure it's in play. Dennis will take a second look at it. Again, there's a 10 foot line there. It must be on the lineup behind it. And it's good, he said. She could say fourth and inches. Look for his fourth spear in the last five boxes here in string number three. Perfect shot, spare. 90 in a ball through seven. Five spears and one strike in the first, three spears in the second, four spears here in the third. On the spare, in the pocket. Still going. Nine. Just the two pin remains. 99 through seven. He's one in the third string. He's up four to two. And missed it right. Second time he's missed a single pin in a row. Made a couple earlier. The Paul Grant Special missed the second, make the third for a 10, 109 through eight. So he's officially won the third string. He's up four to two. Winning the first, losing the second. He'll increase his lead in the match. Comfortable lead. Then hit, look at this, you gotta be kidding me. A check mark and a triangle. How often do you see this shot? Yikes. Seven for nine, the head pin here in the string. Been all over it all day. Good effort. Triangle, six, nine, ten, and the seven. Seven goes away. Now it's just a clean triangle. One, two pieces of wood looks like, maybe three. Man, one of the hottest balls in the game today. Wide left, seven, one, sixteen, three, nine. So he's gained 10 pins in the total. Right now it's 43 in the match with the ball with the box in hand. So he was a spare one, a quarter whist to fill. And it's a punch with a two pin on that spare. Tough break. Then it's a 62 half. Not enough. Lucy drills down eight, has the nine and ten. Nine for ten in the first string of the head pin, seven for ten in the second. Eight for ten here in the third. Allah Dean Sullivan. And the spare. He's got it. One twenty-six in the ball in the tenth. Five spares in the string. On the bonus, in the pocket again. He has seven. The two holds up. A 133 for the second time. 133 to 106. 133, 111, and 133. 377 for Dr. Seuss. He wins it by 27 and leads the match by 60. With two strings to go, the Atlantic Candlepin Singles Tour, Class A Division, from Lita Lane's National New Hampshire, Paul Grimfie Live on ACST Facebook page. And for those watching on Candlepin Bowl Network and Candlepin Chat, we welcome you along. This early matinee special start off at around 11 a.m. this morning. Dennis, welcome to the ACST. Matt Seuss, it's been fun to watch this year.
Pass goes right. It's five. One, two, eight behind the two pin. Piece of wood to help, maybe. Six, ten to the right. Ten is six spares and one strike so far in the first three strings. That will not get the job done against a bull like Matt Susie. Oh, what a shot there, though, for a spare. Must have heard me. Ten in the ball to start the fourth. On the fill, both right, only four. 14 up to one. Dennis deals in sports, TV, and movie memorabilia. His personal collection it consists of tons of Buffalo Bills helmets, Ozzy Smith, and Emmett Smith memorabilia. Oh, he got to go somehow. Second spear in a row, 24 in a ball through two. He'll take it. A stolen spear. Good for him. Welcome, Joshua, and Ray Set watching from Sydney, Nova Scotia. Please subscribe free on YouTube to ACST Facebook page and Candlepin Bowling Network. And watch that thrilling matches yesterday. Candlepins for Cancer, the four ladder series. Incredible bowling. Two 169 strings. Had a 457 three string series and a 451 series. Another shot for Spare! After that five, Phil's got three in a row to start the fourth. He was doing great in that second half of that third string. Three spares and four boxes and a quarter whistle to end it. The one fill. Nice start here. Right again. Half Worcester. Two. A four, five, and a two fill though. 41 through three. Trying to bounce back. Raise the head pin. And you, this is a rare leaf here. The 5 8 in the middle, the 7 left, 6 10 to the right, one piece of wood. That's two on the right. 7 box, 48 through 4. And it's so frustrating as a bowler. Three marks and just averaging 12 pins a box. Dennis Nuzzo, Z-Z-O, in the pocket, nine. 72% clean shot at this here, pro bowlers that would. Stats provided by Candle from Bowling Network. For a spare, right on it. Four spares and five boxes. Very promising half overall. The fills weren't that great, but 58 in the ball. He's down four to two in the points, winning the second, 114, 111, but a pair of 133s for Matt Susie, the difference. Matt Nash and Hampshire his whole life. A big Slipknot fan, music band, and loves his PlayStation. Susie so goes left, has the 1, 3, 6, and the 7. Hello, Stephen Mung. I uh, should pronounce it Dalhousie, New Brunswick. Thank you for watching. Great to hear from our Canadian friends. Susie so for spare. Oh, too full. That looked good. Just a sniper shot. Bullseye. 3, 6, and the 7. It's of 60 coming into the fourth. And nice out for nine. Almost got to the seven. Not quite. Down five in the string. 14-9. Up against a 58 plus one half. Four spares from Dennis Nuzzo. And I believe only hit the head pin once in those five boxes. Man of 119 league bowler. High single 189. There's a nice ball for a strike for Dr. Seuss. 19 plus two through two here in the fourth of five. Second strike of the match. To a triple strike in the ACST finals against Justin Waters. And that fourth string was down. 
at 164 and end up winning it by 14. Great battle you can watch on Caleb from Bowling Network. Justin Waters, another terrific bowler against Matt Susi. Defending Pro Division Championship, now Class A this year. Double strike! Bang! Wow! Double strike! And Justin Dennis is putting a move on. Matt Susi said, not so fast. 30, make the 39 plus bonus balls. Hammer time. Hello, Corey Smith. Thank you for watching. It's a great game of Kenneth from Bowling. That is a wow. Going for a triple, but we need to help back door to do that. 247, correction 124. 27 that first double strike box, 36 through 2. Now it's 46 plus a ball there. Yeah. Raise the head pin, not quite. Want to go a little more inside, good effort. Leaves up the six, the uh, four pin. 19 that second box, 55 through 3 and a 9, 64 through 4. I want to sit on it. That's what a double strike will do for you. Another strike bid. Broke up the spread eagle. The two to the left, the three, six, ten to the right. So you see, trying to go one to three. Got the object pin, nothing else. The three, six, ten left up. Another great half. Nine box, 73 half. Had a 75 half in the first, a 58 half in the second, 62 in the third, 73 here in the fourth. And Dennis does it despite four marks. It's trailing. The difference are the fills. A double strike by Matt Susi, the current ACST champion. But Dennis on a spare. We shift over to lane 34 here in Lita Lanes. Just missed that pin, got six, the one, two, four, and the nine. He's got two pieces of wood, maybe three to help. 64 half, just down nine in the string. Nice shot, will it go? Oh, right, two pieces of wood by the nine. Heck of a bid. Nice 10, 74 through 6 in the 4th of 5 from Nashua. Week 2 of the 18-week season. Two points for a win, one for tie, four for total. Matt Susi leads, four points to two. One, two, six, and ten. These two marks to have a chance to string, maybe three. Outside. One, six, ten. And that's not going to guarantee against Matt Susi. Gets the short two for nine. 83 through seven. Matt is 73 half, so he needs a couple of marks minimum, maybe all three. What really hurt him is those fills. Four, five, and two. And a seven box lower to score. Back and head pinch crosses over. Look at this, the five seven. He's it to the far right. I don't know if that'd be much of a factor unless it moves in there. Maybe he will. Let me try to carry it off the wall. Nothing, nothing to lose here. He goes to the five pin. He's up to seven. I'm gonna try to crack at that wood. What do I know? Nine blocks, 92 through eight. Dennis only win is the second string, 114, 111. Matt, 133, 97 the first. Dennis, 114, 111 the second. Matt, 133 again in the third to 106. 
Another good ball there. Another split. The 2 4 6 10. Only one. Try and go for two. And gets one for an eight. One hundred through nine. Needs a mark here. Otherwise, Matt in the driver's seat to go up six to two. Matt ten and four coming in. Dennis inheriting Joey Lister's ten and four record. Half was to right. Good second ball, another split. Four seven six ten. Another 10 spares and one strike in the match. Nice out. Oh, pretty shot for a 9. 109, fourth string. That brings us to just 426 through 4. The 110 league bowler, 14 under his average, but trying to work his way back up to his 123 glory days. It'll get better. Susie in control here in the string and the match. Nine right now. In the open half. He's just 37 in five boxes to go up 6 2. He has the one, two, and the ten. The head pin is one of the ten. He has two marks in the string, a, both strikes, a double strike. Nice ten. 83 through six, up nine in the string, box to box. Matching number is 27 pins in four boxes to win his third of fourth strings. One more to go after this. Class A division. Bundle of six left up there. Leads up the head pin. And a ten. 93 through 7. We've got to put this up at the last string. My apologies. That's the score through 3. We're almost done here on the 4th. It's been all Matt Susie. 377 and 317. And up here in the string, they're about to clinch another string. The 6 7 leaf. Shannon Scripton made the shot at the women's doubles event. Clutch spare in the ninth box in that 2 string final. Watched on Cannon Bowling Network. A thrilling finish. Great to see the women's tournament. It's getting going again. Inside. Field goal. So Matt's going to win this string. 9. 102 through 8. 8 pins and th 2 boxes to win it. Speaking of ladies' game, tomorrow night I'll be up in Scarborough at the Big 20. At 6.30, the Tuesday Night Speed League, a special presentation from Maine on Candle and Bowling Network. Amanda Carroll's team with Brooke Federich and Mother Sue Brown. Sue Seek gets five. Take on Team Shannon Scribner with Kelsey Layton. who are in the final of the Women's Doubles event. And Kristen Hayes, Big 20 at Scarborough, Maine, tomorrow night on Candle and Bowling Network. 6.30. Oh, what a shot! A spare in the ninth. Fisher has won the string. 112 and a ball. Only his first spare of the string. He has two to strikes. A double in the second and third. On the bonus. 
No split. Has the two, the uh, three and six in the right. 51% chance to convert for Pro Bowls that would. Stats for Butterfly Count Ball Network. 129. Off the wall. Got it. 130 the ball. Third string and 130 plus. Two spares, two strikes in the string. 15 spares, three strikes in 40 boxes. A two and a 132. He thought he'd get a three, he said, but nothing wrong with the 132. And that puts him over 500 for four, 509. And he wins at 132 to 109. Add 23 more. He's up 83. So there's totals pretty much in hand. Unless we see a miracle from Dennis. Matt Susie, 132. Another fine performance. I'll put the, the official scores up in just a moment. This is box by box. Double strike the key factor there on the string. A couple of marks to put the cherry on the top at the end. Got a fifth string now. Dennis Nuzzo, the triangle, the uh, diamond in the seventh pin. He said the diamond's his favorite shot. But they only go about 27% for pro balls that work based on Kent Ball Network stats. Missed everything. Eight box to start the fifth and final string of the match. We'll talk to Matt when the match is over. Nice ball there. Five seven split. No wood, no luck. Right. Eight box, 16 through two in the fifth. Dennis trying to get at least four points here and go to 14 and 14 in the season. It's been all Matt Susie. Dennis did win the second string by three. 114, 111. It's week two matchup, the Atlantic Conference Singles Tour Class A Division. From Lee Lane's National Hampshire. On the head pin, multiple times today, he's had a 2 2 split. This time it's the 2 4, 6 10. He's got two pieces of wood. He did make a 2 2 split earlier. No spare. And he almost did it again. What a try. Pin ricochet off the wall and left up the 6 pin. Valiant effort. Ball short. Cleans up for 10, 26 through 3. Matinee Monday from Lita Lanes. Again, just a recap of the first four strings. Matt Susie, born like Matt Susie. Been a machine the last few months. Dennis, half Worcester for the umpteenth time. Punch out the 3 and the 9. One seven and the six ten to the right remains. Nice out for an eight. Thirty four through four needs a mark. Totals in jeopardy, obviously down eighty three coming in. They're trying to get at least two points here in the string and get four. And you're getting four out of fourteen up Matt Susan these days is a vic is a victory. Dennis Nuzzo just missed the head pin, has the one, two, and a wobbling four. And it goes back almost into the two and the one, but not quite, just a little behind. Spare chance here on lane 33. You take advantage, no. Ball comes back, but it won't go. Just a little bit off. And 
Paul Grant special. Missed the second. Make the third for a 10. The 44 half. And Matt Susie going to going to try to go for 12 or 14. Up 83 coming in. He's had really good strings. 133, a 133, and a 132, and a 111 in the second. Turning off his fifth string here. One, two, seven, nine, and ten. This would be something. Oh, what a try. That looked good. Only got two of them. And a, a seven, nine, ten. Worse than the Susie special, the five, seven, ten. Eight box. Tied in the fifth. I'll be to the 44 half. Friday Night Pro League, September 30th, this Friday night after 8 p.m. on Camelton Bowl Network. It's Central 2 hosting Woburn 2 after a slow start. Central on fire, 20 and 4. Tim and Scott Douglas, Chris Winniars, Rich Lamoni, and Dan Chenard, who won the doubles title with Stephen O'Neill Jr. Saturday night in Haverhill Academy Lane, takes on Central 2 bowlers. Nate Lees, Dave Allahan, Mark Hollywood Smith, Scott Lapier, Ed Woodside, and Steve Vino Jr. 5 of those ball at Central Park Lanes. Great week four matchup in the Friday Night Pro League. So we see the 1 2 4 and the 10. He's up the 1 and the 10. Susie at 10, up two in the string, 85 in the match. My printer messed up last night. Uh, there's a Calipins for Cancer roll off October 11th, 13th, 15th, and 16th. $80 entry fee. Register Calipins for Cancer.com. Calipins for the four, Cancer.com. Welcome, Wayne Felch, watching this great game of Calipins Bowling. The TV live show is December 18th, Force of Bolarama. And the qualifying rounds also, Force of Bolarama. Pins fly there. So please register. Candlepins with a four, cancer.com. If you can't bowl, please donate to the charity. Candlepins four, cancer.com. Over eleven hundred dollars raised yesterday alone. Seriously, good try, almost. In the ladies tournament, also for the Candlepins for Cancer, a women's live show coming up also. Susie at 10, 28 through three, up two in the string. Up a boat load to match. The ladies. Campus Cancer qualifiers are in Scarborough, the Big 20 in the live show, January 14th on a Saturday, 11 a.m. on Campus and Bullet Network. The qualifying rounds are November 29th, December 1st, December 3rd, and December 4th. At Big 20 Scarborough, May, please register at Campus for Cancer.com, Campus number 4, Cancer.com. So we're lost in October for anybody, and ladies were lost end of November and December. Campus for Cancer.com to register. Great matches yesterday. Watch more Canada the Bowling Network. Sushi open half so far. Nine box, 37 through four, three in the string. 86 in the match. Tomorrow night, or Thursday night rather, I should say. Tomorrow night will be in Scarborough. Thursday night in Manchester, Class B matchup. Four person matchup, 6 p.m. Again. On ACST Facebook page, 10 and 4 Faye Sawyer and Red Hot Kevin Bacon. Kevin Baker, Kevin Bacon, Kevin Baker. As Susie slams a strike. Took on the bacon there. 47 half plus two. His fourth strike of the match had double in that fourth string. Red Hot Kevin Baker. Averaging 102, 103 last year. 117 right now. So far in the fall season. That's a watch from right, the 13610. Also, Paul Mitivier against Ken Dubray, 4 and 10, Lakeside Lanes, Manchester, New Hampshire, on ACST Facebook page. Thursday night, 6 p.m. Chop up the head pin. So, again, that's Thursday, 6 p.m. Jay Sawyer, Kevin Baker, 
Call M and N D. That's one nine. Looking for his first mark still here in the fifth. Fifty three through six. Please subscribe free to ACST Facebook page and also the Kellenpin Bowling Network for outstanding Kellenpin Bowling. That's so only five. One, two, eight, six, ten to the right. Both ball is ten and four coming into today. Good second ball. Leads up the half west to left, the two, eight, and the ten. A seven, sixty through seven. Frustration setting in. Here's the first four recap. If you missed it, if I didn't put it up either. That's too soon. Try and get over six hundred again. No, it's over three. Good second ball, another split leap. You can't believe it. What you got to do to get one? 6 10 right, 7 left. Eight box, 68 through 8 here in the fifth. Matt Susie has been unstoppable of late. He'll be a, he'll be a Saturday, the 20 stringer in Nashua, Lita Lanes. Plenty of them available if you want a ball. Contact Matt Susie or Lexi here at Lita Lanes to bowl. Tori Lister, one of them. One here also, 20 stringer. And he's taking his place here in the hole. Yikes. Just a miserable string. The standards. A tough five. 785, the last three. Just 73 through nine. And that's Susie looking at your 12 out of 14. Great odds now. Off the head again. Four's been left, the one, two, four, seven. An open string. Octogenarian string in the 80s. 982. Just 508 for three. Matt Susie, 47 plus two, working a strike on lane 34. The final five blocks of the match. The only blemish, the second string loss, 114, 111. 133. 111, 133, and 132. Three to the right. Working on a strike. We put the one, two, and the eight behind the two pin. Seven on the strike. 54 half up 10 in the string. The seven, 61 through six, up eight in the string, but just needs 22 in four boxes to win its fourth of five strings and, look, and take the match all the two. And now we're putting a 22 and six. And I'll guarantee him first place. Susie trying to steal a strike. It's eight, has the two and the four. Strikes in the match. And out the wall, got to go for a spare. 71 of the ball through seven. Five spares in the first, three in the second, five in the third, two in the fourth, one here in the fifth. 16 spares, four strikes. Off 
On the bonus is three. 74 through seven. Half Wester, one, four, seven, six, ten. Seen the show made a few times, not too often. And on the archer pin, just six eighty through eight. Just needs three pins and two boxes to win the string and take twelve or fourteen points. We'll talk to Matt Seuss before we sign off. Nice ball for a strike, it's nine. Three pieces of wood. Third mark of the string, won't go. Roadblock. Needs two tens just for a hundred, but he's got the string one. And the match, obviously. Ten blocks, ninety through nine. So right now for the match, he's at 598. Just a typical Matt Susie day at the office. Nine more. Almost another strike. Will it go? Weevils wobble, but they don't fall down. Spare in the 10th. 100 in the ball. He's hit 600. <laughs> on the bonus, strike on spare to wrap it up. Five strikes in the match. 17 spares. Wow. 110. And ends up with a 619 for the match. Taking 12 of 14. He now is in first place in the ACST Pro Division. Class A Division, I should say, this year. Class A Division. Dennis Nezzo goes to 12. And 16. We'll talk to Matt before we sign off. Look at these scores by Matt Susi. Matt taking 12, 133, 111, 133, 132, 110, and a spare strike to end up with 4th, 5th, and 110, 619. Let's talk to Matt Susi before we sign off. Matt Susi, oh. just another day at the office for you. Yeah. 619, a couple of strings below average, but three 130s plus. Can't run, nothing wrong with that. Three out of five. I'll take it. What happened at half west of two? You're supposed to get a three in that fill. You get a 133 for the third time. So I said, I'm like, I need that three. <laughs> <laughs> I was going triangle. No, Worcester. Oh, well. So tell us about your world tournament team coming. What team are you going to be bowling on in the Worlds this year? Do you know? You know? Bowl with the Mass Holes. Yeah. It's actually sponsored by here now. Okay. Uh, it's me. Chuck, Nick Leach, Austin Barnes, Rio, Pete Crawford, Jack Berrigan, Joey Lister, and Matt Nichols. And yourself. And myself. Okay. It'll be a fun team. When I mentioned the Cheetahs last year, you told me you've never won anything. And I said, and you, and you came in fourth out of four that day in the finals. And I said, nothing wrong with being four out of 64. No. This year, it's been a complete turnaround. A St. Patrick's Day title. An ACST championship and a 10 string championship, also. Now you got a 20 string this Saturday. What has been the difference, you think, from last year to this year on your way up the scale? I'm just pushing this here. I said, I've been bowling well. I'm going to keep it going. I want to be up there with those top dogs. Yeah. I want them to look at me and go, oh shit. 
So the remarkable thing with last year, if you didn't know, Matt Susi was two and forty against the first three playoff holes and beat all three in the, in the playoffs. That was amazing. That was a good fun stretch. Now I got to do and, it again. This and you year. get the trophy here that lead lanes the counter still. I do. So, <laughs> look for a repeat this year. So good no, start. So you're now ten and four the first week. You're now twenty two and six. How's it feel to be in first place by yourself in the division after two weeks? Eh, two weeks. I mean, it's a long season, yep. but it's great. Yeah. <laughs> Give a three-letter word. Describe wow. it. All right. There you go. Matt Susie, congratulations. Well, thank Good you. Good luck Saturday in the 20-stringer. Thank you. Dennis Nezzo takes two. Matt Susie takes 12. Dennis, you'll get it back next time. <laughs> I don't think I ever had it. Yeah, you know what? You, you competed. You tried. I knew you were frustrated a lot. It happens. It's a funny game, isn't it? First day back uh, in a while competitively, so it happens. I just couldn't get comfortable up there. I, yeah. I owned the three-pin. Nobody could touch the three-pin, so I think Matt <laughs> hit it a couple of times. He owes me some so, uh, royalties. So you get, so you get royalty fees in the three-pin, I guess, he, huh? Yeah, Matt's got to give me some royalties. Right. You know, we should start doing those, uh, getting donations every time he's a half four star. Okay. Quarter could for every half four star. We could do that, too. <laughs> Probably more, more than the lemon drop. Yeah. You can start that pool if you want. <laughs> Thanks for being gracious in defeat and defeat. Uh, uh, talking to you us. You win all. some, you lose some. I'm back here in two weeks against Nick Lee. So tell us about it. the the people who always saw the memorabilia, how they get a hold of you, what you what you're selling, what you're doing. With yeah, that. just um, message me on Facebook, Dennis Nuzzo, or uh, it's on Facebook at uh, Nuzzo's Memorabilia and Collectibles. I have everything under the sun, whether it's sports, TV, movies. Uh, I deal with Sports World and Target, so I can get just about anything, music, anything, anything you need. Just contact me, and I can probably get it. You do wow shirts too. I can do WoW shirts. <laughs> that, come, come on, I'll be exclusive deal for WoW shirts. How about that? All right. Good to see you again. Good luck the rest of the season. Thank you. Right, take Thank care you. of yourself. All right. So Paul Green stands so long. A presentation, Atlantic Camelopin Singles Tour. Recap of Matt Susie 12, Dennis Nezzo 2. Thank you for watching this great game of Camelopin Bowl. We'll see you in Scarborough, Maine at the Big 20, 630 tomorrow night. Amanda Carroll against Shannon Scribner's team from the Big 20. Thank you.